Correct. So that murder charge just comes seven months after Harley Ray Williams was found unresponsive here behind me. She later died at the hospital. Today we were back out in the neighborhood talking with people living here and they tell us they're still hurt by what happened and wish they could have done more. 33 year old John Hardy was already facing several charges related to the death of his girlfriend's two year old daughter, Harley Ray Williams. Today, second degree murder was added to that list. Both Hardy and the child's mother, Shelby Love, are behind bars for her tragic death. Previously, we spoke with a woman who has met with Love several times and claims Hardy is the only real criminal in this case. He should be charged with murder. I think I think he is guilty. I think that um, like I said, he should have been in prison. So this guy is a very violent man and he deserves to be in prison for the rest of his life. Back in April, police were called to a home on 20th Bay Street in Norfolk's Ocean View area. They found the child unresponsive. She later died at the hospital. A few months back, we spoke with someone who knew the couple. It's hard to think that anybody you know could do something like this. And we all have children, so. If it was one of our children, we would want that same support. According to investigators, 30 to 50 percent of the child's body was burned. Investigators say the little girl was not taken to the emergency room for 11 hours until she passed out from her pain and wounds. We're told the cause of death for two year old Harley Ray was complications of scolding. Back when we first started digging through court records, News 3 learned Hardy was not supposed to be around children unsupervised as he had pled guilty to fracturing his own child's skull back in 2014. Love's defense counsel argues she was in an abusive relationship. Now, Hardy's trial for these charges is expected to begin in January.